Hi, this is Jay from Aquilumination, and this is a service update for our Nero 5 submersible pump. This is a really uh, quick and easy update and relates to bearing noise if you hear it on either a brand new pump or on a pump that's been in operation for some time. So to demonstrate, I'm going to open up this new pump. And what we're going to do is remove the propeller guard. Once the propeller guard is off, what you want to do is remove the propeller, and then you want to inspect the inside of the propeller. Inside, there are four holes, and these four holes allow water to move from the back of the pump up around the stator and drive shaft, and then out these four holes. If these four holes become clogged, either with lubricant from our testing on the line or from detritus or calcium buildup, what will happen is it will impede the water flow, causing the bearings to heat up, which will then result in your pump making noise. In order to clean it, if it's a new pump, then most likely that's lubricant. All you need is a household Q-tip. Simply wipe around the inside and then wipe around um, the stator housing here where there might be some lubricant and with that removed you're good to go. If it is a pump which has been in operation for some time and these holes are clogged with uh, calcium buildup or something along those lines then you may need to soak um, the wet side in a one-to-one -one white vinegar water solution to break that up and clean it out. Once it's clean simply put it back Put the housing back on. Make sure that you rotate it until you hear a click because then you know that it will be locked back in place and you should be good to go. At that point, if you are still hearing bearing noise and the four holes are clear, please contact our customer service as they may be able to assist you further. All right, thank you very much and have a great reefing day.